eight times in a row. Uh, so Kofi won this earlier. Uh, namely, he said because he started DIing away on a lot of Falcon juggles. That's like such an easy thing that a lot of people don't remember. <clears throat> but, uh... <laughs> oh, Kofi, come on! That's how you're gonna start? In Losers Finals. That was a good option, didn't quite get anything off the, um... Oh my god! Oh my god! Uh, double knees the stock, like, immediately. Okay! Alright, gets him off stage. Uh, this is super important. Doesn't quite get the down tilt to stuff him out. Good roll in. Chris is hard reading the roll away. Up air. There. There, it's gonna kill. <laughs> I'm mistaken. Oh, great spacing! Grab ledge! Back here. Down smash works. Uh, this is... <laughs> closer than it looks considering one good Lucario combo will take the stock. Not if you DI in twice in a row on that. Yeah, Chris wants his revenge from earlier. They went to game five earlier, so it wasn't it wasn't a shutout, but um And that's the issue, whenever these two play. Uh whenever these two play, Double needs to put in so much work to win. Whereas um if Chris puts in an equal amount of work relative to him, he just sorta of steamrolls. This is the nature of his character, I think. Once he gets Falcon going. Uh, that I don't think he should have Oro cancelled that down tilt. I mean, in these high intensity situations, it's really hard to think about that. Um, and that's like super duper top level stuff. But just speaking from 2020 perfect hindsight, if you're in that situation as Lucario and you recognize um, and you recognize that you're not really going to be able to punish on shield, instead of Oro cancelling your down tilt, say, you're going to want to down B out. Good DI mix up from Double though. Uh, okay, I mean, that trade is, is chill. Yo, Jack, can you move the chat up just a little bit? What? Can you move the chat up like a hair? Right. No one's talking, it's just it's bothering me that I can't read the very bottom of it. Oh, buddy. She wins. Okay, cool. Um, probably, if we're going Green Hill, that's, okay, I think they played here earlier. This will be good for Lucario. Well, that's the thing, he's not going to be able to use his super longevity here. Um, yeah, I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it plays out. Yeah, Nave, don't be ashamed at all, dude. You you were doing... Okay. okay, yeah. I couldn't tell if this was like... If this was your sad face or your pondering face. Because that was good. DI away. Kofi was like blowing a gasket over here. Um, yeah. Um, that... Okay, good dodge on the up air. Okay, good mix up to go back to ledge, but now he has no charge and didn't get anything off the up tilt from ledge. This is super, this is super rough. I'm gonna say, like, next two hits he's gonna get a charge back, but I'm not sure it's gonna be enough. Considering he's already down two stocks. There's a the charge, but. Oh, stuff's now with Horse Sphere? Oh, yeah, it doesn't quite crawl back far enough. Oh, what? Yeah, Chris is styling a bit. 
Yeah, double rarely getting caught without a charge, but he's been doing it a lot this set. Uh, he knows he knows his percent, so he knows when he's gonna get it back, like there. But um, usually with double, his aura management is so good that he doesn't have to be in a situation where that happens. Are you talking to me, Jack? Okay. Yeah, that dash attack was kind of autopiloty. Uh, he was probably hard reading Chris' approach. Um, which, against Chris, you can't really do. Yeah, that's gonna be the safer option there. Is, um, the short hop fair. Oh my gosh! Okay! Woohoo! That's a combo. Did anyone else see that? Everyone's on their phone. Aaron, I don't think, was paying attention. Long day at the office? I can tell. Me too, Aaron. Me too. Good wave dash back by Chris. Oh, that's it. I would have laughed so hard if he died there. He's dead. PI away. Is it a desktop? Or I'll correct myself to DI in a direction that doesn't make that happen, because that's just that's just hard to watch. It is 12.30 in the morning, and we're only in losers finals. We still need to watch either Ivysaur Falco, or maybe like Sonic that doesn't try. I don't know if Chris is going to be trying. Good DI away by Chris in that situation, uh, to avoid the... Uh, to avoid the down tilt. Good up tilt from ledge. Yeah, look at how hard Chris is DIing away those um, those aerials though, because that's how you're gonna mess with Lucario's mid air combo game. And Chris knows to do that. Excuse me. Chris knows about that too well. Back by Chris. Oh, grab ledge. Oh. Okay. Um, honestly, fair from ledge there was probably, <laughs> probably this percent not what you want to do, because Chris is kind of Chris is in, in the zone. Yeah, he's gonna need a raw something or a charge side B. And without a charge. Alright, he gets the charge back. Okay. Yeah, Chris is enjoying himself in this night to see. Oh, that was kind of wonky. <gasps> oh! He wanted runoff fair into side B, I think. Oh, yeah, like that. Got sort of caught by the edge the last time. Wow. That was hot. That was that was also equally hot, though. It's kind of rough. Down tilt in the side B. Uh, maybe if you connect on shields. I mean, I, I'm not sure that's what Kofi wanted. I'm just saying hypothetically. Um, a cool one is uh, first hit up B cancelled in the side B, because that's totally a thing you can do that I don't really see anyone do. Um, mostly because it's just second nature to cancel your up B into something else like Thor Sphere. Alright, well. 